Hello guys, it's Ninad here from Team Eureka Info and in this video we are going to learn about rooting your Eureka after Kenozer Matwell or Lollipop update. Perfect. Come on, let's get started. First of all, download the files in the link in the given in the description below and install adb setup.x click y by by every time when it ask and finally click on next button and finish button yes and now go to routing your folder and there you need to copy root.zip file to your internal memory card sorry to your external memory card after copying that switch off your phone and make sure that uh, the file root.zip is successfully copied to your Eureka's memory card and after that power off the phone wait for some time yeah the phone is switched off now now through the USB cable connect your phone to your computer while connecting hold the volume up button since you need a phone to go to fast foot mode now by pressing shift and right mouse button go to open command window here and you can see a terminal here and first of all you need to paste the first code in here the first code which is given in the description below in here and click enter it it verifies whether your phone is unlocked or locked bootloader is unlocked or locked if the bootloader is unlocked then no need to unlock it again if it is locked then paste the second code which is given in the description and even in the notes in the zip and press enter now if your phone is not un unlocked bootloader is not unlocked it will ask for format you click s yes, and uh, as soon as possible the uh, system unlocks the bootloader after that you would place the paste the third code which is given in the description and it rec successfully flashes the recovery file to your mobile until then do not touch your mobile and it, it should look like passport mode as as you can see here in the screen itself after that you straight away remove the cable do not touch anything straight away remove the cable and now you can see the phone turned off and there is no cable now by pressing volume up and volume up down and power button you go to recovery mode press the three buttons three to four seconds until you logo appears and the uh, you will go to the recovery option immediately and by pressing the volume up and down keys you can move up or down and by pressing power button you can select any any files and then now go to second option install zip and there you go to your internal sorry your external memory card the, where you placed the root.zip folder now you select root.zip folder and press power button yeah you can see root.zip there yes and there you go to yes install root zip and press power button and the installation process takes place like this we were unable to record the whole process of installation since uh, we had an issue with the camera uh, where we were using another phone as a camera so we are really sorry for that after the installation process the we screen goes to the previous menu and press go back button and then press reboot system now and in this window you click on yes fix root you can even switch off the phone directly by removing the battery but it is not good so follow this method itself yeah the phone is switching on now you can see the synergen boot screen animation there we have skipped skipped some part of the videos because the booting of the phone will take much time so we have deleted those portions 
and you can see android is upgrading wait for some time and your phone is successfully rooted now to verify the root uh, we are going to show you this method to verify the root you go to root checker app you can install it from google play store and you click on verify root option and you grant the permission for that after granting the permission you can see the congratulations your phone has root permission thank you for watching if you have any queries related to routing please leave a comment below uh, we strongly recommend you to follow the same procedure since uh, it is very safe and it handles your phone smoothly and without any soft brick or hard brick if you use the previous methods which are used for KitKat version your phone will be soft brick in in that case you leave a comment we try to solve it as soon as possible in this video if you have any queries doubts and you did not understand any steps in the middle please leave a comment we will try to help you and like the video if it really helps you to root the phone and subscribe our channel for more updates tips and tricks and bugs fixes on you your record